Washington, D.C. hasn't seen this many troops since the Civil War. With today's ALG Minute, I'm Katherine Mortensen. The images of the inauguration are chilling. It doesn't look like a peaceful transfer of power. It looks like a government scared of its people. Fox News' John Roberts is reporting the D.C. mayor requested crew served machine guns for the National Guard's arsenal at the inauguration. Now those would be 50 caliber weapons so large it takes a crew of soldiers to load the ammo. According to Roberts, Homeland Security official Ken Cuccinelli denied the request saying such weapons have no place in securing a civilian event. And it's not enough apparently to be guarded by 25,000 National Guardsmen. The mayor is also vetting every single one of them, not to ensure loyalty to the Constitution, but to ensure their personal loyalty to Joe Biden. Biden's installation looks more like a banana republic coup than an inauguration. For more, check us out at thedailytorch.com.